Hey guys, welcome to the second night of problem solving. Uh, the first thing I want you to do before we do anything is I want to change the values of these. So that 4 becomes an 8. You're going to double every number. 2 becomes a 4. This 10 is going to become a 20. And I want you to change this $2 symbol to a $4. Now, let's read the problem. Caleb and Chloe are buying tickets for rides at Wild Water Park. Together they have exactly enough money to buy either 8 tickets for Bumper Blast and 4 tickets for Spider Climb, or 20 tickets for Bumper Blast. If a ticket for Bumper Blast costs $4, then how much does a ticket for Spider Climb cost? Well, the first thing I do know for sure is it tells me that Bumper Blast tickets cost $4. So I'm just going to write Bumper Blast equals four dollars. And notice I did it in a little code here to help me. Um, that is what we know for sure by this. Now what do we have to find out to solve the problem? If you look at the very end of the problem it says how much does a ticket for spider climb cost? That's what I need to know. How much do spider climb tickets cost. Now, the second part, what does the problem tell you about how much the tickets for Bumper Blast and Spider Climb cost? Well, I do know that Bumper Blast tickets equal four dollars, and I know that um, we're, we don't know Spider Climb. That's what we're trying to figure out. So, we don't know that. But the thing I do know, guys, if you look back up the problem, 20 tickets for Bumper Blast. If I have 20 tickets, boys and girls, we just studied this skill, too. If I have 20 tickets times $4, do you know what 4 times 2 is? Everybody knows that, right? What is 4 times 2? Well, that's 8. Look at how many zeros. One zero. So, how much money do Caleb and Chloe have all together? I think we know how much money that Caleb and Chloe have. Wouldn't that be eighty dollars right there? Do you see how I did that? Twenty tickets for Bumper Blast. They have enough money, so that means they have eighty dollars. Hopefully, you guys understand that. Now, with that knowledge, that they have eighty dollars. If they were to buy eight tickets for bumper blast could we figure out how much eight tickets are because do you know eight times four dollars do you know that eight times four equals what think about it eight plus eight is sixteen another eight is twenty four and another eight is thirty two so boys and girls if I bought eight tickets for bumper blast wouldn't that cost me thirty two dollars yes it would so now four tickets for spider climb we know they have eighty dollars right we know that bumper blast tickets are four dollars so eight of them times four is thirty two now could i figure out how much money the spider climb is i think so boys and girls watch if i take eighty dollars which is the money that Caleb and Chloe have right and I subtract it from thirty two dollars uh oh I have a bunch of zeros here don't get nervous about that zero minus zero is zero zero minus zero is zero to bring your decimal straight down zero minus two can't do that. I'm going to borrow. Bring make that a 7. Make this a 10. 10 minus 2 is 8. 7 minus 3. What is that? Is that $48? And I will be back. Remember, there's $48 left. Let's go back to part 2.